mouse invited a frog into its nest, saying, with crumb and seed, it was fully blessed. These two were not the best of friends, but mere acquaintances who would lend each other bits of useful things. One day the frog invited the mouse to sup and dine at his house. It was a dampish place hidden beneath an exposed length of willow root. The mouse declined. It shook its head. It's out of the question, dear frog, it said. The chance of crossing is rather slim, for mice were not designed to swim. Nonsense. The river seems twice as wide when seen through a mouse's eyes. Tie yourself to my back and then I'll jump across to the other bank. seemed a good suggestion, so the mouse decided it would go. Halfway across, the treacherous frog decided to land on a floating log, and here it thought about the mouse's nest, and about how, with seed and crumb, it was so fully blessed. It thought it might be rather sound if the owner of that place drowned. The mouse struggled to get free. It pleaded and screamed of treachery. It attracted a passing bird of prey which bore two struggling things away. Now two nests upon two banks are both without their occupants. And only the passing river knows this tale of two peculiar foes. <laughs>